Greetings with a tarot love. Um, my name is Anita, by the way. I hope you guys are loving the new setup. I am loving it so much. I'm going to try to always do these beautiful flowers. I did this myself. They're so pretty. Okay. Today's reading is going to be for air signs. Okay. Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. This will not resonate with everyone. Please take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Energy is fluid, so the roles can be reversed. Um, so the only thing that matters is if it's resonating with you, then, then the message is for you. The link for the extended will be in the description box below. And also, thank you to all of my subscribers. I really appreciate you. I just want you to know that I have made the extended versions of old some of the old videos probably like two three weeks um, from the beginning of my channel those extended versions are currently free so if you go back into my videos um, if you wanted to get an extended and you didn't purchase it then it's available just so you know okay and I also have my link for personal readings in the description box below Okay, let's see what we have for Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. My messages are timeless. Okay, we have the magician. So you guys are in a space of really creating a lot for yourself, um, manifesting things for yourself. A lot of you are putting out the energy to manifest things specifically. A lot of you are in a really good space. And so you are attracting those things that you want to you. You might be realizing this or you might not be realizing this. And if you do not realize this or if you are not intentionally manifesting anything to yourself, then now is a really good time to manifest things, okay? We have the Seven of Cups. Okay. So I do feel like a lot of you are not sure about what it is you want to manifest. You might have a lot of options right now. There could be a lot of choices. Okay. Emotionally, you can be very unstable as well. Um, some of you do not know what to choose in when it comes to matters of the heart, you don't know what to choose, okay? And so even though you are in that power of manifestation and you are attracting things to you, there's still some confusion here, okay? For a lot of you, you are working on different things when it comes to your career, your finance, money. Um, you're trying to focus on that right now. You're trying to focus on the money right now. However, there can be options in regards to, you know, what career path, you know, what business venture, um, and you're a little confused about what to choose here. And so I feel like you are manifesting this, this, this money to flow into you right now. You're manifesting a lot of money, but there's also a, some doubt because it's like you're not sure about what it is that you should be investing into right now. You're being the queen of pentacles. You're serious about um, business, investment, your career. But you're almost like not sure what it is that you should be investing in right now. Okay, now we have a relationship. Some of you could be dealing with an earth sign. We have water sign as well. Two of cups. So this is also in regards to relationships, okay? So it's like, you don't know 
where to invest your heart. It's like you're not sure which relationship that you should be investing in. If you guys hear the rain outside, I have the window open, so it is raining right now. I think that's a peaceful um, sound for the background, so. Yeah, if you, it's like you're not sure where to invest right now. That includes, that includes your time, your money, your heart. I feel like it's like all of these things. Clarify for air signs. <clears throat> Clarify for air signs. King of Wands. Some of you could be dealing with a fire sign or someone with um, fire in their chart. Leo, Sag, Aries. Okay. And this is concerning this person as well. Um, some of you are manifesting this person, okay? You might be wanting someone to reach out to you, to contact you. You might want to reunite with this person, okay? Um, but this person, um, you're really attracted to them. There's a lot of fire and passion here. This person is very driven as well and going after what they want. Yeah, you want a new beginning with this person, whoever this is. So yeah, you're wanting a new beginning with this person, whoever this King of Wands is. You're wanting them to take action towards you to reach out or whatever the, the case may be. I'm sorry if you guys hear any noise in the background that I have no control over right now, okay? And it's also like you guys are not sure where to, like, take a risk here. You guys probably aren't sure if you should take a risk with this person. Firefly for air time. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Mm -hmm. So you're hoping for a victory with a new beginning with this person. Um, and I'm seeing that there is a new beginning coming here actually with, with this Fool and the Six of Wands. Okay, but I feel like you don't know. You could have more than one option here with the Seven of Cups. And you might not know. It's like you don't know where to start over, where to start anew. You know, that would make sense for you, okay? But with you being the Queen of Pentacles here, um, I see you working very hard towards a victory here that will come for you in the future. And I also see that you're hoping for a victory with this person. Yeah, because you're putting a lot of, I just said hard work, like a lot of work. And there's work in regard to this person as well. But I see you putting in a lot of hard work hoping for a victory. This came under the two of cups. So, yeah. You are putting in work in this. When it comes to your career and also when it comes to this relationship, whatever this is. We have the two of, of pentacles. You're trying to create balance here. You, I feel like a lot of you do have a lot going on with this um, Seven of Cups. It's like there are so many like things going on, so many options or something like that for you. You're trying to create balance here with this Two of Pentacles. But um so yeah there's a lot going on and then here's the five of wands so you're having a lot of internal conflict about the decision and about the new start okay clarify for air signs angel spirits guys in the universe for air signs Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, what's going on? Okay, that wanted to come out. We have
have the four of swords and we have the seven of swords with the eight of cups okay so once again we have you working really hard towards a victory that's coming for you you know i see your hard work paying off okay all of the hard work that you're doing is not going in 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 vain you know all the hard work will not go in vain i have the six of cups and then we have the four of wands okay so as i said you know some of you could really be be struggling about where you want to settle down as in commitment marriage who you want to be with and this is this four of wands it's like there's some type of wedding or, or you know engagement or something coming in but um, we have a seven of four swords and the eight of cups so i'm definitely gonna get some clarity on this but it's like i don't know if it's this relationship like you've been working hard towards with this king of wands we have a, the queen and the king so very strong earth and fire here okay um but there's something over here about like secrets and walking away emotionally let me get one more card oh the higher fence and the world okay okay so whatever is going on here with this person, it's coming to an end with the world. The cycle is coming to an end, okay? The cycle is coming to an end. But with the Hierophant, I feel like there's something that's, it's either a commitment, it's something official. We have justice in the background, the emperor, uh, the hanged one, and there goes the king of pentacles. So a lot of you could really be, oh my God, they're so many major arcana back here some of you could really be um committing to an, an earth sign so taurus virgo um capricorn or you're already committed but i see a cycle coming to an end here all right and it's like for some of you you could already be committed with this person i feel like you were hoping for a victory and um, a new beginning in that commitment that marriage whatever that is you are hoping for a new beginning but with all this conflict and all this juggling and trying to make things work at the end of the day it's like when you do finally reunite or come together I see like some type of secrecy betrayal someone is walking away emotionally but regardless, this cycle is coming to the end. We have justice. So there are like truths coming out about this situation. Okay, guys. I'm going to go deeper into this in the extended and, and see how this King of Wands is feeling. And even clear up the, the Queen of Pentacles. I feel like this is you, air sign. But the roles can be reversed here. Okay, before I go into that, let me get some dealing with angels oracle cards So, 
Archangel Michael is with you. We have new beginnings and new love in the background here. So for some of you, this could be someone new, but I feel like this is something old, you know, and it's like you're trying to have a new beginning with this person, okay? Archangel Michael here, your angels are with you, trying to protect you because you're very, you know, indecisive about things. You need clarity here. We have truth and integrity, you know, so someone is not being true and honest here. We have the Seven of Swords. We have the Seven of Swords with the Eight of Cups. So it's like, I feel like there is some type of betrayal, secrecy, someone like lying or doing something that causes the other person to walk away. I feel like I'm going to clarify that in the extended, but with truth and integrity, um, whether that's you or this other person that needs, you know, that needs to happen in this connection to create harmony here, create balance and surrender and release. Okay. All of this internal conflict that you're having, you have to surrender and release and let things flow. Okay. I'm going to see what answers the universe has for you regarding this situation. And then I'm gonna go into the extended. <clears throat> oh Lord. I'm trying not to mess this up, but whatever. Let's shuffle. they might have that's interesting it says the time has passed and the time is now I should have looked at the placement <clears throat> like where it fell just around the corner what do we have for our air signs Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. The time is near. Okay. You are co-creator with the universe in the background. Okay. So that's definitely for the manifestation, you guys. This is the main card um, of this whole connection. I have spring in the background as well. But listen, this is the, the main thing here. You are in this manifestation power. Co-creator with the universe. So... I think you have to figure out what it is you want with the Seven of Cups. There's a lot of like, I don't know what to do here, okay? The time has passed. I feel like this has to do with the connection. And I think with this progression, the time has passed. The time is now just around the corner. The time is near. It's like enough time has passed in this situation. And now it's time for things to move forward. The time is near, okay? just around the corner i feel like this is this person that you've been wanting to reach out that is coming soon the time has passed i feel it has a lot to do with the time that you have been in a space away from this person this person's been away from you that time has passed okay and the time is now just around the corner the time is near all right Thank you so much, Air Signs, for joining me. I'm going to go into the extended now and clarify a lot of things. I'm going to find out how your person is feeling towards you. I'm going to get some advice here as well. Thank you so much. <clears throat> 